This is pop-up architect. In the, we can see the visible faces for a quarter of a sphere, and on the right picture, the resulting planar layout for a pyramid. This is what a tool can do. This paper architecture is hard to do by hand. The learning tool helps to speed up the transition from a 3D model to a paper architecture by having a 3D model as the input and producing a planar layout of the paper architecture as the output. It takes in a 3D model and produces a planar layout of the paper architecture corresponding to the 3D model. We have an animation portraying how the paper architecture would close and open in real life. The tool of the paper that our authoring tool is based on is pop up automatic paper architectures from 2D models. It submitted to SIGGRAPH in 2002. It talks of three steps of which we plan to implement two. One is computing the visible surface and the second one is computing a proper realizable surface. The user inputs a backdrop, a ground plane, and a 3D model that intersects the backdrop and ground plane, facing the positive C direction. Then create a grid that holds the model and the two planes. We can the visible faces from a point along the positive C direction. We then computed the pop-up realizable surface through a region-growing algorithm which satisfies patch ordering conditions. We established the ground and backdrop patches and then worked our way inwards and added new patches of faces that were connected to existing patches. The next major step we implemented, which we implemented on our own as it was not included in the paper, was an animation of the realizable pop-up foldable surface to demonstrate that the model is acceptable for creating a paper architecture. For the final major step, we created the planar layout. As this approach was not clearly specified in the paper, we decided to render out the animated pop-up in top view while the pop-up is completely open. Yeah, from the beginning. Part of our plugin most integrated with Maya is the UI and the rendering of the planar layout as well as animation. All the other computations are created in C++, with almost no help from Maya C++ API besides from accessing the meshes and their characteristics. Our demo of our tool in action. Our user interface, the user has the option to create a planar layout, create a visible surface, create a realizable surface, and create a realizable surface animation. All the user needs to do for each of these is to select a mesh, a backdrop, and a ground plane. In this example, we are using the command to create a visible surface. Here is a demonstration of the command to create a realizable surface animation. This can be very useful to the user because it will show if the user's input model is acceptable to create a pop-up foldable architecture. We create the planar layout. Our algorithm was successful with fairly simple models.